Hi everybody, thanks for tuning in to the video on this 2019 Dodge Grand Caravan. This particular Grand Caravan is the GT trim level. It's one of the top trim levels for the Grand Caravan. Going to give you a full leather interior along with heated seats and a heated steering wheel and lots of other extras that we'll go through as we go around the video. Starting off here in the front, uh, both the SXT and GT trims, which is the middle and the upper trim, are going to give you a body color grill insert rather than a black one like you might see on an SE. Uh, and you also get the fog lights integrated into the lower portion of the bumper. Coming around to the side, um, an upgrade that this GT has that all GTs may not have is the 17 inch gloss black wheel. Of course that's wrapped up with a Michelin tire. That tire looks to be uh, two thirds, two thirds strut or so. Good amount of life left in that. Of course you do have the body colored mirror caps as well as door handles. The rear doors are both power sliding doors. You just pull on the door there and it'll pop itself open. Looking into the back, of course you do have the uh, second row captain seats, third row bench, so you can see three across the back, two in the middle and two in the front for a grand total of seven passengers in the car. Um, it does have the classic Grand Caravan stow and go seating. You pull these floor mats up here, there's a compartment underneath there, you pull that compartment up, the whole seat will flip right into that compartment flat with the floor. Um, one of the greatest things that made uh, Dodge Grand Caravans dominate the minivan market for years and years. Um, of course, back here you can see where your backup camera is mounted underneath the uh, Dodge emblem. Let's uh, pull the hatch open. It is a power hatch, but it seems like it must be disabled right now. You can disable that if you're uh, worried about uh, parking inside of a garage. There's a button in the front. Um, right there's the button for the power hatch, and I'll put it down with that. Um, so just like the front seats, the rear seats can fold up, stow right into the floor of the car here. You can have a flat load floor the whole way from the front to the back. Um, or, obviously, this doubles over as a huge storage area. So in addition to seating seven passengers, you can also carry a ton of cargo, or you can do some mix of both. You could have, you know, your front seats, your second row seats up, fold these in, and four people, and even more cargo. So lots of different ways to configure this van to suit your needs. Uh, carry the number of people that you need to, as well as all the cargo that you need to carry. So like I said, just push the button there. Let's jump into the front, take a look at some of the features in the front. Of course, power windows, locks and mirrors, standard fashion here on the door. You also have your power third row window vents. Of course, those third row uh, windows don't go down like a normal window, they just open up um, like a vent. Uh, the driver's seat is a full power seat, 10-way adjustable with a two-way lumbar adjustment there. Jumping into the inside of the car here. We do have two keys. All our vehicles come with two keys. That's about a $300 value or $300 value per key to buy this key from Dodge. Um, something you shouldn't overlook. Uh, keys are worth a lot of money now. And we make sure, like I said, we give you two. Firing it up. Good miles in this van. Uh, so just over, or just, excuse me, just under 38,000. So you have a good amount of your five year, 60,000 mile powertrain warranty. Um, of course, it's not low mileage. But you still have your powertrain warranty, of course, with a lot of these vehicles coming from fleet type services, the miles that you're going to find on average with minivans are going to be a little higher um, than you would with other vehicles. Coming into the center stack, AM, FM, as well as Sirius XM radio are equipped on the car. In addition to that, you do have a uh, navigation, I believe it's powered by Garmin. So Garmin navigation equipped on the, on the vehicle. Backup camera is also going to show up there. In addition to those radio options, you can also Bluetooth the audio from your phone to the car the same way that you would a phone call. Moving down, dual zone, automatic climate control for the driver and the passenger, so somebody must have been a little chilly earlier, so we're going to turn this down to 72. Um, since there's not another pe person in here, I'm going to hit sync. What that does is it syncs the driver's temperature with the passenger's temperature and the rear occupants. If there were different people in here and say the driver was hot and the passenger was cold, you could adjust these temperatures independently of each other, and each person and area has its own climate zone. Uh, short of that though, like I said, hit sync, syncs them all together. If you then go a little further and you hit the auto button, it will try to hold 72 degrees just like your house would. Super cool feature, dual zone automatic climate control. Um, it's on a lot of the more modern vehicles. It's definitely a little underrated though. People never ask about it and it's super handy. Rather than being constantly messing with your climate, you just set it like your house thermostat. Heated seats for both the driver and the passenger. Two function, high and low. And also a heated steering wheel for the driver. Now over here you do have some additional storage, a little storage up here that actually goes pretty far back in there. Another USB port back there as well. Let me put the seat back real quick. 
when detail was detailing the car, they must have uh, been vacuuming under this seat because it was way forward. Inside of the glove compartment. Not only are you going to find your books down there, you'll also find the results of our, our multi-point inspection. It tells you what we did to it while it was in our shop, as well as the measurements of the key wearable parts on the car. So taking a quick look at this, we did replace the cabin air filter. That's the filter that filters the air that comes in through your heating and cooling system. We put new uh, windshield wipers on. We gave it an oil change and we replaced the engine air filter. It's going to filter the air that uh, comes in through your engine, gets you better uh, performance as well as fuel economy. Um, looks like uh, new tires. Um, and brake service, 13 bonded in the front and 12 bonded in the rear. Um, just full disclosure's sake, I think they might have their vans confused because these tires look to be about 75% tread to me. Um, we did have another identical van. Um, so let me just real quickly. Yeah, like I said, full disclosure on that, I'd say that those are about uh, two thirds tread or so. Something like that. They're probably about eight, nine, 30 seconds. They are not brand new, but they're about three quarters uh, Michelin Energy Saver tires. So if you're looking for a great van at a great price with tons of equipment, you, need, you like that uh, heated leather seats, heated steering wheel, power doors, power hatch, um, this might be a great option for you. Stop out and check us out, 21518 Great Cove Road in McCallsburg, Pennsylvania. Visit us online, allthingsautomotive.com. Give us a call, 717-485-4224. Thank you very much for watching the video. Hope you found it to be informative.